Hello, everybody. How are they? I got my daughter in Tarasport today. First of all, congratulations. I'm so proud of Adi. You know, she carries second for her house. Me too, I carry second. Her mom took carry second. Whereas today we are the silver family. <laughs> hey, up Niger house. Niger house for life. Hey, well, till Adara leaves primary school. We are Niger house for life. Niger house, Niger house for life, baby. Ah, oh, what a day today so far. Yes, yeah, so I want to do this live today. I don't hint on them yesterday. You know. And uh, we need to really decide who the monsters in this country are. Not all of us like to yab Tinubu, we like to yab Atiku, which I like to yab them where we're at. But no, we need, when we look in the mirror, we got to ask ourselves, you know, some questions about some kind of things we some people they do for this our society. But before I enter this story, today live, we go long small. Sumo, sumo, sumo. At the top, my little brother will say sumo, 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 sumo. Anyway, <laughs> oh god. Oh, before I go today, make a yap, can you waste? The one we do us, no, can you waste? I've told you, is from Eastern Nigeria. West, Eastern, and West. Uh, that's Western world. <laughs> can ye? Can ye? Uh -uh. I don't see people get that kind can something. Can can all those things in Alango. Can, 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 can I yo? Can ye? Can I yo? He's your guy. He's your guy. He's your guy. He's your guy. Uh uh. I mean, the lie. You know, say when we do this person, uh, Janet Mune. Uh, you know, DJ. Uh, when she tells me she be Igbo, uh, I come back and tell you, say, ah. Janine, I will get. I give you your own. The can, 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 your can, ye, can, ah, ah, people, ah, ah. <laughs> people, people, they, ah, no, I don't agree. You, this was it. I can your day. I did can ye. La la, la la, you, la la, la la. I don't agree. I don't agree. <laughs> well, let me bring that one. Well, let me bring that one. Are they can ye? Can they wait? Never, never. You don't enter. Now, can I yo? Can ye? Can ye? Can yo? Can I yo? Ah ah. Why don't you do like this? <laughs> ah, but what guy don't win you? What guy don't win you? <laughs> he say his name that ye now. <laughs> oh, which ye? <laughs> no, ye is African. Ye is. I even present the talk ye now. Uh, ye pa. Now you no, no, no. I want a ye pa. Now the short form is a ye. Eh, we don't care now. I let the talk ye. Eh, this guy don't. Yeah. <laughs> but really, really, before I talk about it, which I want to talk about, I not be about am per se. About this group of so-called you know rich blacks as i like to call them all over the world for because they're not african even the rich people will get money for a year they're just black and please read france fanon black skin white masks black skin white mask black is a necessary step in our evolution in this oppression for sure because we are slave we are colonized then we are black but you can't stop at black Black is the stepping stone to your final destination, Africa. You that you are stuck in black, that means you are aspiring to be white. The only place for people stuck in black to go is white. Because they are afraid to take the necessary logical step. Africa. That, that is what was taken from us. Now, what you then from us be that? Our identity, our dignity. That's what was taken. Africa was taken from us. It's still taken from us. The resources, the power, the energies of Africa is still taken from the majority of the people of Africa and given to blacks who are afraid to be African.
to from our own personal perspective first. The revolution within, the revolution within. You cannot be a revolutionary without destroying the oppressor within yourself. The pedagogy of the oppressed, Paulo Ferre. The manual for executing, exercising the oppressor spirit within yourself, to see it within yourself and remove it first. That's the initial revolution, to remove it, your aspiration to whiteness, and move to Africa, your, your indigenous identity. Reclaim your dignity. To the anti-black, just wants to be white. When you are anti-black, as an African person, you don't want to become African. Because if you understand blackness, blackness will teach you how to be African. That's why some of the most revolutionary African teachers waiting for this world were African Americans. Those so-called blacks, the real first blacks, where they're black up, gone. The African Americans are the most revolutionary African scholars. Is it Dr. Amos Wilson? Go on YouTube and watch any of Dr. Amos Wilson's video. He's not from uh, Nigeria, he's not from any African country, he's from America. See, he will, so he will dress in a suit where you know, but Baba will give them kente on top. He will knock African heart, he will put bead because he don't reclaim his identity. He don't understand. Franz Fanon from Martinique. Now he writes the book where they tell you now, black skin, white masks. Are you, af you are afraid to be African. So not only when it comes to African matter, they take science. Now what I want to talk about with this, so why is it that when it comes to African issue, science is never believed? Everybody will say Africa is a black continent. No story that 2,000 years ago, everybody here was black. Black, really black, black. But you see, they argue whether Egypt, Egypt is Egyptians are black. You will see, they argue. Eh, hey, but Moroccans are Arabs. Hey, you <laughs> could they argue? Is alien that builds the that alien built pyramid? Since nobody believes on a good day, oh, science no back alien anything. Alien built the pyramid. Yes, 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 yes. yes. Now, can you say we are Indian? Where we get DNA? DNA day for this world. There's DNA, the ribonucleic acid. Ah, she won't more way. Oh, more way. Oh, more way. I mean, we don't say that the green of DNA be that. Ah, Mugbelele. We say, Jamo, Jamo, Mrs. Kuti, Jamo. My block here, my block here. If you check your DNA, it will tell you who you are. Can you wear please? Go and show me what part of your DNA say you are Indian. And for him to even say we are Indians, means that he wants to say that they are from America, that they didn't bring them as slaves from Africa. There's, there's a theory, a stupid mad theory among some Americans, uh, some blacks in America, anti-black blacks. They are anti-black blacks. Those rich blacks, they don't want to believe they are Africans. They are anything but African. They are ready to be Hebrew, from Jordan, uh, Christian, Muslim, anything. But just don't call them African. They are ready to be anything. Even if it's going to say it's from America, you should say, I'm a Native American. To show you how white he is, he say, we are Indians. How much Punjab DNA is inside Kanye West's body? Kanye West should go and do a DNA test and show us his results. And in how about that? Uncle Ruckus. Uncle Ruckus. Uncle Ruckus. 102% black. Riveri Ligo. Yay. Please go and do your DNA. Why is science? Never brought in. Why don't they use any time African issue? Even our economy, as our economy, they go on like this. Where are the intellectuals? 
Where are the equations? Why we say an opinion, opinion, opinion? Bring, come and discuss these things based on the theories of economics. We say we learn for school. Come and discuss it based on the theory of sciences. We say we learn for school. We say we be professor, PhD, and this is what is bringing me to this topic. You fucking so-called professionals. How you? Are, what professional are you? What professional? In all your institutions, now you go be on our guard. Like Chris. How many of you are competing with white people in any field in the sciences? All the company for Nigeria carry Oyibo director knock on her head. What does that say about you? All the companies carry Oyibo director knock on her head. Then the government per the state house, we know if you employ Oyibo knock on her head, we go employ Oyibo contractor knock for on ahead there to execute what you are supposed to execute now go take there for site when they build bridge they take order from where you both like be slave for 2024 now no if you build anything no if you build bridge and if you build drain and if you build light and if you do school and if you nothing all the private school for nigeria now you both be the head school head, head teacher all of them i thought they come from one my daughter school today now you both be the girl of all the teacher there too what professionals are you where, where are you competing where are you competing? What does it mean to be a professional? See, this is where capitalism don't fuck on up with that as Nigerian professionals. What does it mean to be make a first start with myself as a musician? What does it mean to be a musician? Share in me, say I didn't make money from music, or say I know music. Say I'm a professional in music. You say I understand and know what music is. I can stand toe to toe with any musician in no me I no make me I no make that. Because there's something about music where they <laughs> my nephew is gonna <to> kill me. <laughs> but I can stand toe to toe uh, uh, with any musician in the world in what I do. I even cross to other genres. Last year, I do hip hop album. Uh, 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 I do soul, uh, soul, soul record with a band. I did for funk record. I do funk song with Common. I did for pop album with Janelle Monet, where I work on. This year, I still they do another. Ah, may I never drop the bomb for now. Mo never announce her. May I not announce her. But I'm still doing another full album. Uh, EP, not full album. This year, too. With another artist outside of my genre, I see they release my album this year. I'm constantly practicing. I'm competing on the biggest stages in my field. When last did they give a Nigerian scientist Nobel laureate? Mm -hmm. uh, scientist, physics, banker, a banker. We come up with one thing. We just alleviate some problems for a country. When last did we win any of those in those? Field where they control our country. Engineering. When last one engineer, they are content so a doctor can sit down and become a billionaire in Nigeria just curing malaria and typhoid. Malaria, typhoid, maybe some diabetes medicine here, some light appendix surgery there, never pushing the boundary of his profession. Never pushing the boundaries of that profession. He, he just allow mediocrity to just sink into his soul. Where we have musicians that don't know anything about music. They don't care. And they have they have billions of naira that if you take okay, you can just take ah forget playing instrument. Tell people say playing instrument, playing an instrument. Many great musicians never touch an instrument. They might understand it. Me, for example, I feel claim say I'm a multi instrumentalist, but it's a lie. It's really a lie. But the truth is, if you put a guitar in my hand, I'll play something. If you put a trumpet in my mouth, I'll blow something. I have an idea of all the instruments I write for. Because I compose for all these instruments. So to compose for them, you don't necessarily you don't have to know how to play it, but you must have an idea of the range of that instrument. You must go into harmonics, understanding harmonics, you know, Okay, no, we're not even going to all these like unnecessary technical issues. But this is what music is. You go stay for your house and you go. My brother, for example, Femi is 62. He still practices more than me, says every day. 
every day you see the practice all the great musicians continue to practice continue to study to push the envelope push the envelope become better and better and better you understand me that is what it means to be a professional to be a professional like that your reward gone, you know you don't really care too much about, say, somebody won't give you one money or somebody understand what you try to mm, You'll be so concentrated on these things you're trying to bring forth to the world. When it will exist if you know day. Because you're going to say, if you know day to do those things, nobody else, now you. You don't feel and say, this is your calling. Now only if you do this thing. That's what it means to be a professional. We are content in this country. Because I say, go look all the... The richest man in Africa, the richest black man, go look in company. How many Nigerians they for top echelon of the management? How many Nigerians they the top echelon of the management? Who be the managerial class of, of these companies? Go to these tech companies, all these fintech companies. Which people they run up? Go to all our telecommunications companies, all the tech department, finance department, new, this department, new. Go look who their guy be for there. White people. Because the Nigerian professional is okay with a gunche. It's okay to be just an errand boy. Yes, sir. Yes, ma. He's there to chop his own. Make his own money. They talk about, you can be a doctor. They talk about, you can be a lawyer. You're going to do charge and bail. You're going to become a billionaire. They defend politicians every day. Till you die. But you never brought justice to your country. In any way, shape, or form. You never change any law for your country. You never fight any case where change any law where bring respite, succor to your suffering people before with your with all your lawyer, everything you get. Are you a professional lawyer? Now go now no fit oh yeah, no talk. Because they say if I talk this one now for court again, they go hold me down. But I can talk the one way for our front. They don't take injunction, cover my mouth for one. I mean, I know yard lawyers finish before they say that that one matter, they talk again. They can, mm -hmm. Doctors in this country cannot diagonize. No rich man in this country is confident to live his life in the hand of a doctor in Nigeria. Doctors in Nigeria, lawyers, engineers, instead of me, they agitate. For the country to fulfill their potential, they are willing to still travel abroad to Japan to go and do the same. Yes, sir, under the Uyibo there. Finally, just made they receive their guy face to face. Just <sighs> somebody say, Oga Shew. How many cases are you fighting in court for it? My guy was like, Bam, me. Motiku. Ah. I'm just not a whiner. I'm not a whiner. If I be honest, a celebrity, the kind of they give me for this country, now every time they come internet, because they make noise, they look for public sympathy. At Omar Akin Lawa. When I know what it is, they do what they won't do. We are with them. I go face them. What are they doing? Until they go, I don't need to stress now. But look, they won't kill me. They don't fit. <laughs> they don't I don't pay lawyer money. Pay lawyer money. So they, I don't broke. <laughs> Cut. So as so I tell you now, what are we doing? As you say, we'll be professionals for Nigeria. We just allow mediocrity because we don't understand. See, the talent what we get is not about money. Hallelujah. Hallelujah, somebody. <laughs> anyway, back to the gist. So where are we in all this? See, we are professionals in our country. What thing would be, what thing be our impact? All this our knowledge. What is our expertise? Oh, they run this up and down the place. Everybody, big boy, big. What are we really doing with it? What are we doing with the knowledge? What we say we get? Because we think say we are, we are using. It. See, until we understand, 
say you cannot divorce development from national talent. Because now waiting the oppressors, they tell you now be that, and they see for TV, they, they show now, you know, the thing that, believe, that they believe lie. Nigeria no go ever develop. If we continue to divorce this nation from a national talent. We were they talented, we always say we will be professionals for this country. If we don't understand, say we must invest those things in this country. Where they don't feel meet our potential, we must agitate and fight for that field to meet our potential. The way they hold and where they stop and we must make sure say they if they don't feel we will remove them, do ourselves. We don't understand that aspect. We they look for individual escape routes. Individual escape routes. Anyway. Until I show me on a company where they run, when I put to you on top of you put up now, guy. Then I'll be taken as serious. Because after this man now, they can bring in face outside. I'll be in name. What's he be that name? Where they give her? Hey, why did they do this thing again? Don't tell where I put somebody picture for my uh, Instagram uh, Instagram live. Ah! How much they say that one thief? He collect $2.1 million so that outsiders can steal $2.4 billion from in country. I think they put picture for this live again. Oh, this guy while I be this. I don't forget. But anyway, all of us see the news. He did my live. I mean, he did my story. You can see the news. I won't call the man name. But if I go into the name, I will tell her the story of one guy. We really call Andrea. I want to say this story. I want to show how Nigerian professionals connive with themselves and will use the law. They go, how they connive with themselves to make sure that this country never moves forward. That only their life. This Andrew Yakubu man in daughter and my good friend. This matter, I don't even know say the, the man, not the gay papa. I never made the connection in my mind. I just see the thing where the man do, the thing bust my brain. I go for life. I yap the man tire. Only for me to find out, say, now my friend, Papa, be that. Not be say, this friend of mine, we never talk. This thing, now over like seven years ago. See, today, we never talk. I mean, I don't want to talk to that kind of person again. Good readers. But so we close. Growing up, I have known this person for like 15 years. All our teenage years, university, we are friends all through. I didn't know I was talking about our father. This man, they found out where they find nine point something million dollars for a house, cash money. Where EFCC, where they whistle blow, where EFCC go arrest them. Mm -hmm. EFCC not do the investigation, no. But because somebody come outside, they were forced to go. Corner, obviously, they were forced to not go and arrest this man. When me and this my friend fight, she had me say me. I don't know what they talk about. Say nothing go happen. De -de 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 -de. And last last true true, nothing happened. But I followed the case. Because I was invested, kind of. So I go tell you how nothing take happen. So I go see how the professionals of this country connive with each other to destroy this country. This man was a GM, just like this other man with the cash. He was a GM in NMPC. They find nine point something million dollar cash for a house, and just like this man, and this man too, we get away with it because just like this man, ES is never even touching the arrest him till now. Now the FBI said they find out. Because EFCC said they know they interested in prosecuting that case. Yes, I said, let me talk with my full chest. And I'm citing Andrew Yakubu's issue as my evidence here. Now, the man say, na gift. Say, na gift, where people they give him. They give him because now Jesus Christ speaking. Now he come from Jesus, direct descendants. People dash a nine point something billion, million dollar in gifts. Now the one where they see in cash with that oh, where they where still remain. <laughs> he said that they give her gifts because in be in the in the in the I don't know what thing they do where they go give in the in the in the tons joy to sorrow in the in our magic in our in our saints. I don't even know what to talk again. So this one a two point one million dollar a chicken change. 
This one where they tell nine point something million, they see from cash. This one are uh, FBI. They say they trace account. They see money. Not be this one are cash. They see the money. When he can't go court, he win the case. And I know how he win the case. The judge talk say the prosecution no proof say the gift when they give him now because in the work for NMPC because the prosecution no bring anybody to the witness stand where give him the gift or no interview or no ask anybody they no investigate anybody where give him the money to ask why they give the money so no evidence no direct correlation here she just come to say we see this money for the hand na na corrupt man is that how to prosecute a case is that how to prosecute a case even the judge now another professional he no sanction that lawyer he no right to bar or to the best of my knowledge where i follow the case reach i know she said the rock say he writes to bar to sanction that lawyer for incompetence for such a poorly executed job the man walked away scot free EFCC make my say we will retry the case. We will retry the case. Now see, both the security arm of the professionals, the legal arm, the judge, everybody just together. The oil worker man, everybody together. Together. Destroying the lives of millions of people. These same people now go come for these their children, not this their lawyer, they go come for outside. They make them see nobody is oh, I'm practical that the governor is this this one that day. Now this man has taken 2.1 million for himself and his family life to better. He allow outsiders, foreigners, to rob us of two point four billion dollars. She don't know what two point four billion dollars can do in the lives of people in this country. That's over three trillion naira. That two point four billion is over three trillion. Do you know how many hospitals? health center, youth center, schools. This can be built with this kind of... Do we understand what these people are doing? But you see, this same person, he go no one come crew, some musicians, some journalists, some... When you go, they dash money, they go come outside down, they go say, you the grace. Some idiot, they go say, why you no go collect her? If not, you don't you know, If not me, I don't go collect her. Speak for your motherfucking self. Destroy us. Humanity abusers. They go on to normalize nonsense. They go on to normalize her. I don't want name name. I sit down for somewhere. Somebody enter up somewhere where I no respect. We be all of them stand up, go greet her. Me and no stand up, go greet the person. The person don't come meet me to complain. Now those these minions, these rats, these pets, they just come surround me. I no go greet them now. Like say they follow them, go collect. Money for a house, I be they feed me, I be I don't understand. I be after they say the things where I get not satisfy me. I be at the fine, what are the fine Rolls Royce? I be at the fine private jets. I be I don't know what they fine. Where I tell them say I no get where they won't come help me. They are all involved. From your musicians to your comedians to your actors, to your, they are involved. To your journalists, to your TV presenters, uh, game show hosts, bankers, oil workers, they are all involved. And the day won't go no. And the evidence is clear in your eye. But because you two, you are trying to be white, you are trying to be like them. Try to be white by force. 
how many times have the workers in this country, the professionals of Nigeria, and they tell you every day in this country, as we are talking like this, me and you, at least 1,000 children will die from our avoidable diseases in this country this week. As they talk to you like this now, avoidable, not this, malaria will kill 30 will kill it a child every 30 minutes for this country. As they talk to you like this, every 30 minutes, one child they drop dead from malaria every day. As they talk to you like this, Lassa fever, uh, people, uh, malnourishment, different diseases, and just killing young people, malnourishment. I don't want to talk about stunted growth, the mental damage that it's causing to them. When they don't go to, they don't even understand what they talk because they never chop enough. To, I don't want to go into all of that. Just say that they die, the death alone. This level of education with the same children they get under under trees, they learn to learn, they don't get school, no teachers, nothing to teach them. Hospital, nothing is working, people are dying every day, trailer they kill us, uh, students go there for bus stop, uh, richest man in the world, the uh, richest man in Africa trailer. When you richest man when if you put break, better break for trailer. Richest man when if you buy trailer, we get better headlamp. Kill everybody, boys. I mean buy a private jet and Rolls Royce. You people have never gone on strike before. Not, no news of atrocity. Now we say because NSC no call strike. Now NSC will tell you to respect humanity. NSC now will tell you, say, humanity is at stake here. You people have never said before, say, eh, kill no shit me, lost no, no, she shall no, no, no atrocity this in our guys they won't commit when I don't so I know you are in support. No matter which one I call, that's why I look people for news. Everybody walk up the talk like say there's no one kind of everybody want the phone, I like, say, eh, because they support Peter Obi for the last election. They are good people. Now they won't make Nigeria better eh, in really. Now don't strike before say how many friendships have you lost? Just only friendships, eh? forget food. How many people have you stopped talking to? Where you say their whole money? Where they evolve? Where you say, Oh my move far. Which sacrifice can you make, Nigerian professional? Where is the line of sacrifice for this country? We must ask the Nigerian professional this question because I they talk Nigerian professional, Nigerian professional. say she won't decrease, she won't because you are the scapegoat. Eh, you know you know go feel wrong, you know go feel wrong. All these now they go japa. Now you they go home, and at the same time we are talking, they go ask you when our children they die, you strike. What did you do? Finish. You know, they go burn your house. They go do what they want to do. They go see you. They go do it. The mob will do what it will. And they will be justified. They will be justified. The ancestors, in fact, the ancestors will inspire them. So, we can't say the ancestors will support it because they're going to go inspire them. You think the poor are stupid. That's your problem. You think they are stupid. That's your problem. Look this Binance company today. Binance in Nigeria. Oh no, I don't, I just, I don't, I don't know who no work with them. We no support them. We no post. We no post them for a com company where our country, this com company is destroying our country. Two so, Oyibo nine they are gaffed. I go see Nigeria. I work in Binance. But now two you both you now got here. Helping you to destroy your country. But they are paying you salary. You are happy. You know, strike. Not that strike for that for that Binance. Where all this thing they are put to our Naira. All of them they shout every day. Naira do not get I say those people they work for Binance. So they will come as I say, Naira is killing us. Naira, Naira dollar. And their company is part of the problem. Working with two Oyibo boys to destroy. They say. 26 billion in on dollars. We say this kind of money no they fear now. You know, they fear because when I said they say that we billionaire, so they don't make this kind of money they sound heavy for now. Here, when I want to say 26 billion dollars a chicken change, Abi, they say these people did 26 billion dollars worth of untraceable transaction out of our country. Untraceable 26 billion. Which kind of people get that kind of money? What do they want to take that kind of money to do? What in the money? What in our economy? How can our economy withstand such capital flights? How can this economy withstand such capital flight? Which president won't do anything about such corporate greed? But 
Our president is not innocent. Don't get me twisted. I'm just saying because they create the atmosphere for these kind of people to thrive. Now, Binance is just one little platform company. If they can be doing that much, what is happening in the banks? When they hear all of them, when they go party for their house, those ogre of bank, if those little boys can be moving that kind of money, what are they moving? Now that one won't invest. Not only Binance now won't expose, say that they move money out of this country. Say now Binance, now Binance they move money out of this country. Now they won't tell me, only those ones. No single bank employee will come outside now and we should blow his bank. Say, see what they say, make I do. Everybody just quiet. Just silent. Just allowing. Because eh, eh, are they fear to die. Now lie, yo. They don't fear any to die. Because me, I don't say, if you put one million dollars inside cage, put lion inside that cage. <laughs> don't say anybody will kill that lion will take that one million dollars. Nigerians will kill around the block five oh, times. No, without bare hand without fight. Oh, no. People go still go fight that lion for that one million dollars. Yeah, so everybody tell me, say, I'm a <laughs> ah. Somebody, somebody don't like Una. <laughs> what they don't bring for this, uh, to, they won't make this life end. <laughs> oh, thank you, darling. Maybe now you're gonna chop this fish and eat it. Thank you, darling. Do you remember? Do you remember? Ah, wait, fish. See how they film this thing, and they see this fish. Hamelo, Hamelo, Hamelo. Hamelo. Almost just like they sweat inside this house. On the second they see now, easy. Uh, I offend you. <laughs> Where they beg you for that they sweat? I don't know anything about on the second AC. Uh, easy. Uh, easy. Uh, easy. Easy. Ah, uh, enemy within. Because I was supposed to have a run for no carry first. Eh, I don't think so. Carry second is okay. Ah, uh, forty one. Second is okay. Oh, you know I want to run for that. No, no, other. Show carry first. Eh, I carry second. I was six feet that time. I'm not wait here today. Second person. I'm not one just day overly critical. Please, please. You are under forty and you carry second. If I want to see in my thirties, I run that run. He said, no, see. Which guy is so? I'm forty one. The Which person where we win was you like you not born. You carry belly for your belly. You carry picky for your belly. You don't born. You only can expose your life. <laughs> <laughs> ah, this is it, eh? Oh more. Mary for tomorrow. Ah. Please, please, please. Ancestors, please. Can bring bring. Yes now. No, no. That other big one. I want to come to Riaza. <laughs> Anyway, they don't bring this fish now to remove me from this life. Somebody say, say that now my wife, they will post say my wife, this is area. They don't have news, say my wife, this is area. Nigeria has been on no work. Anyway, as I be telling that they go, my people, they all connive actively to make sure that you suffer. But because we are won't be like them. I won't be like them. You just want to make Nigeria suffer if you have the chance. Everybody, if I enter there, if I enter there, are these people mad? Hey, I don't get it. See, if you are not great, hmm, it will be hard for your children to keep that wealth that you say you are accumulating for them. It will be hard. But if you are great, even the wealth where you will not make when you are alive, your children will chop out when you die. And they tell you facts. My pop, see, all in colleague get money pass when they are alive. 
all in colleagues. When in their life, nobody will he get money pass. When I grew up with my dad, when in their young, like they my brother, he get money like them who instead of going to the money life. But when fella bomb me, you know they do any in fact they no send money, you know, you no know want. You know, show you know what we do they bring money here, everything get condition, condition, condition. But I cannot deny the greatness, the wealth that the greatness can bring in future. And where that greatness comes from, it dedicates in talent to the national development. It dedicates in talent to national development. Our talent as the professionals of this country cannot be divorced from the development of this country politically, economically, technologically, socially. We cannot be a yes man, yes sir generation. We must be true professionals in the sense of the word. And to be a true professional in the sense of the word must be to be patriotic to our nation, to use our talents to push our country forward. That's the authority. And that's what we will begin to do great things. Because if your talent is invested in a country like our own, we get many things to solve. You gotta use your talent to think of those problems. Whether you need for banking problem, new engineering problem for road, for bridges, for drainage, you will be doing great things. Architects will go design our eco-friendly public housing system. Where is that architect? Where the engineer will go back them up? Where the banker will go provide the money? Where the government will go inspire all these things to happen? Oh, yeah, shop one yeah. Abel, Nigerian professionals, stop pulling my hand. Stop pulling my hand. Thank you very much. Mm, I want to talk one more thing, but this thing don't confuse me. How? Oh, see us, this fish sweet. Ah, for this, for this nubunomi. Now nubunomi with this so oh, no, sorry for this nubunomi for this nubunomi where we did you know go to chop this kind of thing maybe people they see you so I wish you all a good day uh, if you are in this life and you are in uh, a space where this talk affects you edge or a do better Nigerian professionals any lot to do better please we, our country no feel we, we, our country cannot afford the people anymore. You can't afford the people anymore. You can't. You can't. At least show some patriotism. Nowhere in this world where, they, where professionals are not corrupt. Nowhere in America, they, and then they corrupt pass. But at least they are not they directly sabotage their country. Come on, guys. This is our country. Millions of people live here, not only you and your family.